Hey, welcome back to Razzle Dazzle Marcus Plays Kingdom Hearts. In the last episode, there was a motherfucking trinity that I forgot right here. And son of a bitch. I just realized I don't have Goofy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run all the way back. Actually, not all the way back. I'm going to jump down and commit suicide. That would have killed me. Sora would not have properly working legs. The funny, the funny thing about this is that you can just go down here and... Wait, does that take you to the bridge? Oh, um... Uh, what the fuck? I can't go back? I can't go back. Huh. Well, alright then. I guess we'll go the long way route. Uh, come on now. I just gotta switch out Goofy just to get this one stupid trinity that I, that I cannot, for the life of me, get. Oh wait, I know how to get back up. I have to use that thing. Who's still alive? Just die. Die already. Die! 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 <laughs> Ah, oh, come on, there's more of you! This stops. Go away! There we go. Dude, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, great, look at that, I'm out of MP now. Oh, we got him. And I just realized... Uh... Well, there's some more time wasted. Um, I also just realized something. I don't have my timer with me. Well, great. So I'm already wasting your time by going back to a save point, and now that I think about it, I don't have any time whatsoever because. I don't have my timer with me. It's charging in the other room. And when I when I when I say that, I mean my phone. As some of you might know already, that I use my phone. Or actually, more specifically, I use that was a weird camera angle right there. I specifically use Siri just for timer reasons on the show, rather. Ah, man. You know, it's been a long day. It's been long enough as it is, like... Oh, uh, what time is it even? Uh, right now, I think it's... It's like 1.30, I think. Uh, I just got home from, like, youth ministry, like, a couple hours ago. I don't know if I mentioned this before, but I'm part of youth ministry called St. Where? Where? Where is this? Oh, thanks, Jack. Uh, I don't think I mentioned this before, but I'm part of a youth ministry called, uh, Salt to the Earth. And I'm an assistant moderator there. And, um, what I usually do at- Thank you. What I usually do after youth ministry is that I used, uh, that I would hang around with Andy, who is a good friend of mine. Um, me and him, by the way, have a Let's Play channel, which also, by the way, Today, like, I just came back from, uh, Andy's place, and together we, we did a live stream for our channel called a and Play. I know, like, he calls it BAM Play, or whatever the fuck he wants to call it now, but he still has yet to edit the channel whatsoever, which is still called a and Play. So, you know what, I'm just gonna... I forgot, there's no save point in here just yet. Ah, great. So the only one, the, the only safe point that I've discovered in this world is at the guillotine gate. Great, I have to run all the way back here. That's great. Anyways, there we go. So I just need, yeah, I just need Goofy just for this one instance. Sorry, Jack. I, I love you. I love you to death, but I, I need this. I promise I'll put you back in my party. 
Anywho. So, me and him just finished like a live stream of Call of Duty... Oh, what was it? Black Ops 3? I don't know. They're all the same to me. I'm not, I'm not big on Call of Duty. Although, I will say I am big on Halo. Uh, that is like Halo up until Halo 4. Anyway, we finished the live stream right now and like... You know, I'm just like kind of like exhausted from not only Youth Mystery because we did the meeting outside today and we played Wiffle Ball. Um, but we... But I also just like completed a live stream. Which I wouldn't even really consider it a live stream because for one thing, no one really watches the live stream. So what we do is that we just like... For the most part, like... All a and play is, is pretty much like streaming PS4 games. And that was the only way that we could set up a gaming channel in the first place. Um, there is an episode that we shot. Yeah, there is an episode that we shot all together. Me, Steve, and Andy. Whom I've also previously mentioned. Uh, we all filmed an episode for, um, what is it, NFL Blitz? And I just not gotten around to editing it whatsoever. Like, one thing, I, I didn't really like how the episode came out and, like, yeah. Uh, I, honestly, like, I know it's, like, stretching my ego a bit, but, you know, I, I just rather just edit stuff, like, with Kingdom Hearts and stuff. Because not only that, not only, like, do I not want to upload, like, something that I don't feel like is worthy enough to go online in the first place, but I also prefer on editing something that, you know, is more controlled, I guess. What am I even talking about at this point? Ah, just, there you go. I mean, yeah, like, I was able to upload, like, episodes of my old Pokemon Stadium Let's Play. And granted, like, if you look back on my episodes of Pokemon Stadium, which can be found on this same channel, by the way, I uploaded them from, like, my main channel, King Blades of Many Productions. But, dude, oh, man. Those, those old episodes, like, are kind of bad, honestly. Because I go on and on about, like, because, for one thing, I pretty much, like, do too much explaining on, like, the game and stuff, when it's something as simple as Pokemon. So, like, that, that first episode of Pokemon Stadium, like, I always, like, kind of cringe at. Okay, now we can do this stupid goddamn Trinity. Uh, what's in there? A Mithril Shark. By the way, I, I love how I passed this up in the last episode, which you guys have obviously seen. And also, it's right behind a fucking door. How cheap is that? For like something as... Come back down, please. For as something as crucial as... Something that won't be around forever, especially if like you fuck up. Like, how cheap is that? You only get to visit Oogie's Manor in like one section of the game and one section of the game only. And if you pass this point, then it's it's gone forever. Again, so how cheap is that really? I don't know. I. I to go back to my previous point, I might, you know, come around to editing that or whatsoever. Or what? This is not going anywhere? I guess not. I might get around to uploading NFL, uh, NF, and it's whatever, the Hockey Blitz game. That episode that we uploaded. Fucking Christ. I, I, I'm pretty sure I made this a point right now. Uh, I'm pretty sure I made this a previous point, but I am not a big fan of sports, and like sports games, I think are like the worst. 
Because for one thing, not only are there so many different sports games, and like all of them seem like the same to me, it's pretty much like Call of Duty, only like it's not hiding the fact that it's pretty much the same shit. Only like with different teams and like different players that are like on different teams. Like to me, sports are just not entertaining whatsoever. Like playing it, yes, maybe. Like today, I, I played with a ball and I had a blast doing it. But if I if I were to watch it, no. Well, would I watch someone uh, I know play? Um, it, it depends, honestly. Because for one thing, it has to depend on the sport and like what whatever. But even then, like, even if, like, because, I'll give you an example. So Andy uh, was recently part of a basketball team, and let's just say that he did not contribute that much to the team, but even by itself, just even, like, the actual game and, like, watching all the players besides Andy, it was such a bore to watch. Like, I just could not get invested whatsoever. All I was thinking to myself is that, you know, I just wish, like, this game would just end or, like, someone would just win already. I just don't find sports interesting whatsoever. I'm sorry. And, like, you have to... And I hate how, like, you have to do so much, like, kind of research in order to get invested in the first place. By the way, this, this is, like, totally easy right here. I just... Beating the shit out of Lock, Shock, and Barrel. Like, look at this. My health is barely going down. All I'm doing is just mashing the X button. Donald, I already had it covered with the cure. But thanks, anyway. We're almost done here. What was I going on about? Uh, sports, I think. Yes. Oh yeah, the research. So, like, I hate how you have to do, like, semi-research in order to get invested, like, truly invested in the game in the first place. You have to research the coach, you have to research the team and its history, as well as the players and all the players beforehand. And it's just like, why do I have to do so much shit in order to, you know, be invested in just one simple game? I mean, can I just be invested in the game just alone? Because all I'm seeing right now are just a bunch of guys in uniforms and like a bunch of names that I'm just very well soon gonna forget. And like, there are like people out there who like obsess over this shit, like completely obsess over it. Like, they know exactly what number all the teammates are and like what what date what day of the week it was. They know what day of the week it was when something happened just by uh, going off of the game that was on that day. Like, take for example, oh, that's the day that the Cubs won, like, zero to nothing. Zero to nothing. Oh, okay, I could have just gone back and whatever. Do I have to hit this thing, or...? Oh, okay, there we go. And what did that do now? Oogie Boogie made us do it. We had no choice. Yeah, right. Tell it, tell it to the U.S. officials. General Schultz. You, you Nazi. Oh, man. Way to get political right there. Um... Yeah, but anyway, there are, like, a lot of people that obsess over this shit, and, like, I'm just not one of those yuppies who do. Like, take, for example, the clearest example I could think of um, when it comes to doing research just to get invested in one simple thing and one simple thing only is, um, a good example of this is Halo 5. Um... I remember this specifically, um, there was a character who appeared in Halo 5 from what I'm told, I never played it, 
But there was a character in there from what I'm told, and like he appeared in there for like a split second. Then everyone was freaking out, like, oh, it's that character. I'm like, dude, that's just like a random guy. But they were like, no, 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 that, that's a guy from like the novel, the book. Oh, I, I had to read a novel in order to like know a character's backstory. That'd be like, oh, we're facing off, okay, all right, all right. So that'd be like if I were to watch Star Wars and I would have to do like a bunch of research in order to truly understand what Lando Calrissian's character was. Otherwise, it would seem like he betrayed Han for like no specific reason. Oh, you boogie! Give me, give me back the heart. But it's like utterly stupid to me, and like I just cannot find myself to get invested in whatsoever. Like I said, even watching the game by itself and like not paying attention to like the teammates or anything like that, or like even the fights really, it's just not interesting to me whatsoever. Like I'm sorry if I like offended anyone who is like extremely butthurt, butthurt over this. And yes, I do say butthurt because. I feel like a lot of sports fans get butthurt a lot. Like, I don't really have any specific favorite team, and like, if I do, that's only because, like, you know, everyone says, you know, they're a good team. Like, take for example, the Chicago Blackhawks, like, people tell me that they're good, I don't know if, like, they're the best in, like, the whole faction, or whatever, but from what I hear, like, they're pretty good. I mean, I, I, I guess that's cool? Whatever, I don't, I don't really care. Any sport whatsoever, I just cannot, for the life of me. Oh crap! I forgot how to, f I forgot how to fight Oogie Boogie. Because I know that uh, there's like some shit that you gotta do. But like, no matter what sport it is, like I just cannot find myself to get invested in whatsoever. I know he like springs a couple traps. Oh, by the way, I totally forgot to add Jack to the party. I think that evil playroom thing was like the last time I would ever. Oh shit! You know what? I fucked up. Did I fuck up? I fucked up. I, f I fucked up. Cause you know what I'm just realizing? There, um... There were like, a couple of chests on like... There were a couple of chests that were... Like suspended in a thing and I didn't know how to get it. Oh fuck man. I, I hate Oogie's Manor. Cause now that just makes me wonder, like did I leave some Dalmatians on there or something? Cause that I'm totally gonna need for like a reward that comes on later in the game. Shit. Whatever, I just hope it was nothing significant. I'll, I'll probably have to... I'll, I'll probably have to like do some research or whatever after this episode. Or if not, I could probably just, you know, do the episode over since last time I... Oh, wait a minute. When was the last time I saved? God damn it, I should have saved in the evil playroom. Oh, no. Oh. At the top of it all off, I'm just wasting time because I have no idea how to fight Oogie Boogie. Like, how are you, how, how are you supposed to fight him? Because he, he throws the dice. Like... Come on. God damn it! I'm trying to... Because I know there's a way that you can... What is that up there? 
I, I couldn't even tell you because the camera was being all weird and I couldn't even jump up there anyway. Uh, what, what are you supposed to do? I, I have no dumb deadly idea how to face Oogie Boogie. I don't, I don't know what the, the fuck to do. Wait, am I in the... Oh, I am. Come here, you bit. Okay, how did I do that in that instance? I, I don't know. Cause I just remembered something as well. Like I don't remember the last time I saved was because I remember um, the last recording session I had was um, the episode for Halloween Town Part One, and like I took a break from that. I, I like took a break from like Kingdom uh, like playing Kingdom Hearts. Um, for just, just a little bit. And, um, I let my PS2 on until I could record again. And, it's, yeah, that's what I did instead of saving, because I was still in Oogie's Manor. And I didn't know where the evil playroom was until now. Okay, come on, man. Oh, come on! How? How are you supposed to fight him? Do I have to do, some, do, I have to do something with the dice? Because, yeah, Heartless show up. I... I... What? Is he just walks around. Am I in the same... I am, cool. How on earth did I get it that time? Oh, okay, I, I, I did a thing. Oh, God, I, I, ser I seriously hope that... I seriously hope there were no Dalmatians or anything, like, in those chests. Because if there are, then I am boned. Well, not exactly, like... It's nothing too serious, but, like... Uh, I... I... Mm, <laughs> just frustrates me. Because this area is just only going to be around for, like, so long. Am I in the same thing as him? Yes, I am. Oh, come on. I just hate how, like, we can only do so much damage in, like, those, those small little instances where, like, we're in the same chamber as Oogie whenever he does that shit. Oh. I guess we can throw the dice back in him? I've been trying to do that, actually. I just... Okay, just... Just... Okay, cool, I'm in the same thing as him. Alright, let's beat the shit out of him. Okay. Dang. Oh, I can. But that doesn't do that much to him, though. And stop doesn't work. And I just wasted, like, a bunch of MP. Oh. 
And I just realized Goofy gave me an ether. I guess he was still carrying some on him. Either that or, or he was using MP Gift, which... I think is a good ability. Oh, come on! Yeah, I threw that back at him, that time. Okay. Now what? And I fucked up. Oh, I see! So, like... Okay, if you step on these things... Then that closes it, right? At least I think that's how it goes. I have no fucking idea. This boss has always confused me. Stop throwing shit at me, for Christ's sakes. Ah! Stop it. Ah, oh, shit! Yeah, see? You are supposed to step on these things. Okay, now I know how to fight him. Oh man, that's such a pain though. Because he just like prances around all willy nilly. And, like he has to wait and shit. Do that back at him. Okay, I just dodged the buzz saw. Uh, where, where'd it go? Oh shit! I let it hit me that time. All right. All right, I got it. I got you now, motherfucker. I I know your game now. I know your game now, bitch. <laughs> Still laughing once I kick your ass. Are you the Joker? Oh, uh, just come on and do your thing already. Just throw the dice and... Okay, what did that do now? Hey... What? Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck, he can heal himself? Oh, motherfucker, I did it too early. Oh, I... Is Goofy hitting you at all? God damn it, Goofy. I trusted you with this, and you didn't... Oh, I'm stuck in here. Oh, okay, so... I, I tried to guard it, and, like, it wouldn't let me. Ah, uh, man, this is such a slow boss fight. Oh god, more buzz saws. And if I had my phone right now, I I I stop and check to see if like there were any Dalmatians in Oogie's Manor. Because now I am like mildly freaked out about this. And very mildly concerned, mind you. Okay, I'm almost, I'm almost done with Oogie. Um... Yeah, let me think about that for a second, because... I know, like, Oogie has, like, a second iteration, just like Ursula. Only his, like, is, like, a bit more... out there. <gasps> Shit! Did I get him? Yeah, I got you now, motherfucker. Don't fucking smack me. 
Yes! Ah, fuck it, finally. Oh, let me... Okay, we're just now at the 30 minute mark. We can spare a few minutes. I had, I had to stand up and check my computer. <sighs> Ew. No one gonna step on it? So, that heart was a field leader after all. Tain Holy Circlet. Ansem's report. I don't think I ever showed you guys any of Ansem's reports. Um, I'll show you later once we collect them all because I think we do. Oh wait, no, it just goes straight to the the part where like it goes all haywire. Was there any way for me to get up there to those chests? Whatever, I'll have to do, like... Man, I'm really paranoid about this, man. Whoa, how did he get so big? So yeah, he just became one with his mare. No big deal. Look! It's brimming with the power of darkness. Oogie Boogie is drawing power from those dark globs. So we just have to destroy those things, right? Yeah. When worst comes to worst in a video game, just go for those big giant things of destruction. Uh, okay. <laughs> it's those little feet. Uh, okay, that's is, this is how we get up there. What the fuck? He's, sh he's shooting fire? Oh, I guess it's oh, he's turned out to spit hot fire, huh? We're fine then. It's I have fire. Watch this. Watch your shit. It's been a lot of fire at you. Put that fire out, boy. My blizzard. Uh, do we have to? Do we have to get them all? Oh man. Like I said, platforming in this game is not so good, and. Like, this iteration of Oogie is just one giant platforming mess. Look at this shit. Where the... Where am I, where am I even supposed to go? Oh, okay, there's one up there. I'm trying to get up there, and it's just like... Sora keeps climbing onto everything. This is definitely not the right Keyblade. This is definitely not the Keyblade I want to be using. But I don't care, I got my magics. That's all that matters. Uh, where do I go? Oh, okay, here we go. Get rid of that. Cool. Now... What the f- Ah, no! Oh, now we got Harless. Ah, shit. What the f- I'm trying to get up here, it's just... Look at this mess. Oh, there's another one down there. I mean, oh, that was close. Beat the shit out of it. Oh, so that's what's spinning the fire. It's coming from that for some reason. I guess darkness blobs can do that. They can spit hot fire. What the fuck was that? 
Oh, it's coming from that thing too. Oh, oh, okay. Man, this is weird. Stop! Oh my god, I'm almost dead. Thanks, Donald, for... Man, I, 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 as much as I really want to rely on Donald, all I'm thinking right now is just, like, like, at a time and point where, like, Donald is just not going to help me. Like, that one crucial time that I seriously need Donald's help, and he's just not going to deliver on that help. That's what I'm always paranoid about. Would you die already? I need you to destroy this glob and you're kind of in the way. Fuck you then. What the fuck was that Heartless doing in that glob? Working on a night move. Okay, how many of these things are to the left? I wish there was a counter. So, oh, whoa, whoa, what the fuck? Dude, you... You can't do that. Whoa, come on. You can't do that to me. You can't fucking take out the platform like that, especially, like... What the fuck is going on, man? Okay, I see one up there. Let this be the last one. Stop! Alright. Oh, there's more. Yeah, let's get out of here. Oh, oh, cool. That was the last one. Very nice. That's two levels I jumped up. In just one episode. And there goes the giant. There he comes, coming down, just tumbling over and over, down, 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 down. Oh, by the way, how is this for logic? He, he shoots the Keyblade thing up at the moon, and then it just drops down into... It's almost as if he was, like, aiming straight at the skybox. Hey, we got an upgrade for gravity. That's something. I don't really use gravity all that much. Sally, why didn't I listen to you? Don't feel bad, Jack. We'll come up with another plan for Halloween. Next Again, Sally, you're looking very cross-eyed in that shot. Or not cross-eyed, but just like dead-eyed. I guess that's it. We'll just have to cancel the Heartless Halloween Festival for now. Aww. Here, I want you to have this. Oh, yes! I love this Keyblade. Visit us anytime, Sora. Next year's Halloween will be the scariest ever. Emotion, memory... We put in all the necessary ingredients. What else do you need to make a heart? What is a heart, anyway? I can't figure it out. Oh boy, let me show let me show you this keyblade right here. It is Where wait, where is it? Oh here it is. Has a long reach and the ability to deal with string of critical blows. This keyblade is freaking phenomenal to me. Because <laughs> just look at the base of the keyblade. It has Jack's head on it, and at the tip of it is a bat. It's like if Hot Topic were to make, like, their own Keyblade, this is it right here. Let me show you. I, I love this Keyblade. You know what? Maybe for a while I'll switch out this Keyblade. I'll switch out, like, the Spellbinder with this Keyblade. Because, hot damn, dude. I love this Keyblade. And the only downside is my MP goes down. I kind of want my magic back. Anyway, that about does it for this episode. In the next episode, um, I'm going to see 
if what I did fucked up anything, and if not, well, that means I have to start over a bit. So, whatever happens, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.